Hey everyone, it's Meg here with Marigold Holistic Pet Care and I am here with Edgar again from the Huntington County Humane Society and this is my youngest daughter, Ava. And we are here in Huntington and we came to, what's this called again? Flag, Flag, Flagpole Hill? Yes. Yeah, Flagpole Hill. Um, it's a really cool, it, it's not a big trail or anything, it's just a quick little jaunt up the hill to see um, the enormous, beautiful um, American flag. And there is a really cool view of the valley down below. So, um, worth a quick little jaunt into the woods. It's a hot day, so I wanted to do something short with Edgar. He has a um, cooling uh, bandana on right now, and we've been walking in the shade and we've taken lots of water breaks. But um, something I want to point out real quick is that what we did today was, um, again, I double leash Edgar like I do with all shelter dogs. But the cool thing about it is I do have a shorter leash on him connected to the harness, and then I have a longer leash connected to his Martingale collar. And it was really fun for Ava because even though she, you know, she's a teenager, but she's a peanut and, um, you know, heaven forbid anything, he sees something, he spooks something, he wants to start chasing. Um, you know, he'll probably knock her over. So I have, as the adult, I have the um, longer lead connected to him as well so that Ava can walk him, but I still have a little bit of control that if something were to happen, I have the longer lead. So if you have a younger child that insists on walking the dog, do so, double leash them, and um, you know, as the adult, you can have the longer lead and as a, a little bit of a, a safety measure and a backup if something were to happen and the child drops a leash or the dog pulls away from them or something like that. So really cool tip. But um, Edgar has been pleasant as always, right? Yeah, yeah. he's been real cool. Yeah, he's, he's a really cool dog. He's super happy, super friendly. Um, he doesn't pull too much, um, but uh, yeah, he's a, he's a pleasant hiking friend, hiking buddy, huh, Bubba? So um, if, you're, if you're looking for a dog, um, you know, check him out at the uh, Huntington County Humane Society. And if you're, still, if you're looking for a dog and you're not around here, check out your local shelter. Again, like I always tell you, um, just because animals are in the shelter doesn't mean there's anything wrong with the animal. Sometimes it is, um, you know, just a, a human problem. The people don't realize how much it, it takes to take care of a dog and they have to relinquish the dog for many, many reasons. Um, it doesn't mean anything wrong with the dog. So if you're looking to add a canine or feline friend to your family, check out your local shelter. And if you have any questions, I guarantee you that the staff and the volunteers would be more than happy to talk to you about which dog might be a good fit for you. Ava, just sit right here. I think that'll be like on this log here. All right. So. <laughs> I underestimated the size of it. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Are you sure? Yeah. Holy babe. I want you. Can, would you be? Ah, what was that? It was his tail. <laughs> I swear. I thought that was like his tail. Like got me, and I'm like, ah, a good boy. Good boy. Hey, you come, people. There we go. All right, you ready? Did you start recording? Yeah. Oh, that's okay.